Happy April Fools, guys. I hope you did not actually think I was going to quit YouTube because I love doing this. Yeah, I mean, I clickbaited, so there's that. But on the bright side, I'm actually going to be heading out to a lake today to attempt to catch my first bass of the year. So hopefully, I'll be able to accomplish that. Okay, so here's the game plan. I am on the road. I'm driving, heading to the local fishing hole. People are always messaging me, telling me they've caught five, six, even nine pounders. Double digit bass live in this, 20 pounders, guys. No, I'm not gonna target my new PV. I'm actually gonna be happy if I catch anything. Uh, a two pounder would be freaking sweet. So I'm gonna head out there right now and see if I can catch some bass today. I made it to the lake. First spot I'm gonna try is along this dam, but it is crazy windy right here, which may be a good thing, I don't know. But uh, see if I catch a fish. Yeah. Well, today is uh, <laughs> starting off pretty shaky. I think I'm gonna go ahead and swim across the lake, get to that nice little rock point over there. That was crazy, guys. I made it over here completely dried off, and uh, I'm gonna try to catch a fish here. I'm not having any luck with this deep diving crankbait, so I'm gonna switch over to my finesse setup and throw a fluke. Okay, I think it's time to try something else. I think I'm gonna try a Senko, get a chatter bait. I switched over to a suspending jerk bait. Fun fact, I've never caught a fish on a jerk bait, so. I'm gonna toss around this little underspin. Oh, shoot. Oh, I just cast it right over a tree. All right, so I've been fishing for a couple hours. Not one bite. Gotta say, I'm not surprised. I uh, was not expecting to catch a ton of fish today. It is still very early spring, this water is cold. I really hope I at least catch one fish today. So I'm actually going to hop in my Jeep, drive to a different location on this lake, and hopefully make that happen. Holy cow, you guys, I just got the biggest stick fish. Well, just saw my first fish and it's not exactly how I was expecting to see it, but it is currently 425, so I don't have too much more daylight left. And unfortunately, I have not gotten a bite yet, so I am feeling pretty bummed right now. This was the spot I've had high hopes for, but it is just not, not working out today. I'm not giving up. I'm actually gonna try a different spot somewhere that a lot of people do not fish on this lake. So hopefully I'll have fish there. If not, I'm gonna have to change up something because it is just not working out today so far. I am quickly running out of time. It is currently 5.30. So I'm gonna downsize. I just tied on this little crankbait Maybe I can get a fish to go for this. Maybe a crappie, I don't know. I'll take anything at this point. Check this out, guys. I s seem to have found a shad. Yeah, I think it's actually still somewhat alive. That is crazy, all right. Yeah. There you go, buddy. I don't think he's going to make it. Toss him out there. Good luck. See you later, buddy. So here's what we're looking at. We're looking at about, at about eight hours fishing this entire lake, and I have not had, <laughs> I have not had a single bite. So it is a, it's been a pretty slow day of fishing. Um,
Yesterday was rough. I fished for about nine hours. I did not have a single bite. Instead of heading back out there today, I am heading to a different spot and I'm gonna try my luck there. On the bright side, it is a little bit warmer today. So hopefully that'll get the fish biting. First thing I'm noticing is this water is incredibly muddy. I started out with this little underspin with a white swim bait. With this water being as stained as it is, I'm actually gonna switch over to a black and blue chatter bait with a little swim bait trailer. Oh! <laughs> Holy cow, that's gotta be the <laughs> the shortest fight of my life. This guy hit it as soon as I was starting to lift it out of the water. First bass of the year. Awesome, awesome. He totally choked that chatterbait. That was, that was so crazy. Oh my God, he's gone. See you later, buddy. Well, when I got out here, I was a little unsure because this water is like chocolate milk compared to yesterday when I had about three feet of visibility. So I wasn't really sure of what to expect, but the temperature today is about 10 degrees warmer. So I think that the fishing is gonna shape up to be pretty good today. I'm gonna get back to it, but it feels good to finally get rid of that skunk after a full day of fishing and no fish at all. That bass took my bait right off the bank. So I'm not sure if he followed it from the deeper water or if he was just in the shallow water to begin with. So that's something I'm gonna have to figure out. But woo doggy, I am feeling so much better after going nine hours yesterday without a single bite. Fish on. Oh, he's off. I thought I was snagged. I was bumping it on the bottom. Oh, it was a fish. Gosh darn it. Maybe a jig. I'm switching it up. I was actually bouncing my chatterbait on the bottom and a bass actually came and picked it up. So I'm gonna switch over to a jig and uh, see if that's what the fish are after. There's a fish. Another fish. This guy came off the jig. That was within the first few minutes. See you later, buddy. There's a fish. This feels like a big one. This feels like a big one. Oh, it's a nice one. I switched over to a Texas rig. Holy cow. Yes. Holy smokes. He's barely, barely, barely hooked. See you later, buddy. Today has been going a little bit better than yesterday. I have caught three fish. I've actually hooked into five, but uh, it's safe to say that these fish are feeding off crawfish. That last guy's teeth were pretty red. So I am right now using a Texas rigged craw. It's a Pretty interesting little soft plastic. Got a lot going on. Um, 
So the fish seem to like it. I'm gonna get back to it, but woo doggy, this is a lot better than yesterday. Okay, a little bit of an update for you guys. There is a pretty intense thunderstorm heading this way. There's supposed to be hail. So I'm gonna go ahead and call it. I have been fishing for about five hours today. I did catch three fish today, um, had two come off. But after that, the fishing kind of slowed down. I made my way around the entire pond without any more fish, which was kind of surprising, but I am not gonna complain because compared to yesterday when I caught no fish, I didn't, did not even have a single bite after nine hours of fishing yesterday. I will take this any day of the week. So I had a lot of fun today. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. I will catch you in the next one. All right, so I just noticed my uh, this line should be going through this little uh, feeder deal. So it lays flat in my spool and mine is not doing that at all. <laughs> That's nuts. Of all the spots I could have casted, I casted literally right on top of a fish. <laughs>